This is demonic possession and today we're going to explain why this happens in yoga. This is a yoga practice. Those videos are from an account on TikTok called Kundalini Activations. Kundalini yoga is a type of yoga that invites in. You do these rituals and you do chant and you do poses to channel a demon called Kundalini. So this is actually a yoga diagram and the Kundalini spirit is that serpent. It's that snake and it coils up your spine and rests in your head and your brain. All these Kundalini demons and Shakti and Shiva and all of these Hindu gods and they channel them into their body and they react like this. They move around like a serpent, like the serpent that they're inviting into their body to be activated. So why am I talking about this? These people claim that this is the same thing as the Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is God's spirit that he puts in our hearts. We can be baptized in God's spirit and receive love, joy, peace and it's like everything in this world comes to life and it's the most beautiful feeling in the world the holy spirit will never make you move your body around like a snake that is an extremely common sign if you're in a church meeting or if you're in some other spiritual meeting and somebody drops to the floor and starts slithering around like a snake that is a demon the holy spirit is not a snake he's not a serpent he will never make your body slither around on the ground like a snake if you remember in genesis in the garden of eden the devil was a snake the devil was a serpent revelation chapter 20 verse 2 says he laid hold of the dragon that old serpent which is the devil and satan and bound him for a thousand years talking about the serpent from the garden of eden that has been the devil since day one this video today is going to be on yoga and if you have more questions leave them in the comments should christians do yoga no the word yoga means to yoke to bind and attach yourself to something Every yoga pose is a worship pose meant for a specific god for a specific reason. The first thing to understand is that yoga was created as a spiritual practice to yoke yourself with energies, with goddesses and gods. It was not meant to be like Pilates. It was not meant to be just like, oh, this is an exercise routine. It's a spiritual practice and a spiritual attachment to these different energies, which we understand are demons. So there is different breath work, breathing techniques and chants in their scriptures and every yoga pose. They all work together to channel these demons and open yourself up so that they can enter into your body. I did yoga. I'm telling you this from personal experience. I had to get delivered from this. It feels really good in the moment and then later on you realize that you open yourself up to demons and there are a lot of different symptoms. I'm running out of time but here are just a few symptoms of this kundalini awakening. This proves that it's not God. Hallucination, depression, physical sickness, and mental illness. Running out of time but hit that plus button for more.